interested in Java, the number is 287-3100. Okay. Brian, I think you found the sweet spot there. I saw Java kind of kicking <laughs> his leg. Did you notice how he was sitting quietly before the camera Yes, he on, was. And then he gets up and starts acting like a dog. <laughs> it's like, I'm a dog, it's yeah. my turn to shine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyway, cute dog. Oh, Let's uh, talk weather. We have some pretty nice days ahead. Here's our weather headlines for today. We're looking at near record warmth for today. Cooler and breezy, though, on Saturday. Also a slight chance of showers on Saturday morning. And a temperature roller coaster ride in that extended forecast. Here is a look at our Almanac page. Our forecasted high for today is 75. Normal is 58. And we're within striking distance of the record. The old record 78, and it's an old record going back to 1877. So uh, some locations might actually break records today. We are forecasting record highs for a few locations in the valley. Not for Boise, but uh, we are within striking distance. It's possible it could happen. But uh, right now we have clear skies outside. Our current temperature looks like this. Boise at 46 degrees, winds at 10 miles per hour, humidity at 76%. And the feels like temperature 41 degrees. 46 right now in Boise, one of the warmer locations. 41 in Napa, most other locations here in the valley in the 30s. Mount locations in the 20s and lower 30s. As far as our story today, of course, we're going to warm up rapidly. Here's the temperatures uh, just after 6 at 7 o'clock. Uh, daytime highs topping out in the mid to lower 70s, most locations, and then we cool back down. Now with tomorrow's cold front moving through, our daytime highs later in the day won't be quite as warm. Some lower 60s for the most part across the valley. And then for Sunday, we'll start to warm up a little bit once that cold front moves on through. And uh, on Sunday, the highs will be in the upper to mid 60s for most valley locations. Here's our forecast. For the valley, we have uh, clear skies, a high pressure ridge centered right here. We're going to slide a little farther to the east with that thing. Clouds pushed up into southwestern Canada, and we stay high and dry. Hardly cloud in the sky across the entire Pacific Northwest. So we'll just skip our tight satellite view because there's nothing showing up on it. And here is our future cast. Now, not much going on until Saturday morning. There's that slight chance of some showers, mainly in the morning hours. We'll cloud up a bit in the morning, but then we'll clear up in the afternoon. Looking good, just a few high clouds to the north Sunday afternoon, but in general, sunny skies as we head on into Monday. As far as our accumulated rainfall, uh, we'll start off with Saturday. Saturday morning, that's when we'll start to see some showers show up in eastern Oregon. Most of it will remain to the north, but you can see Boise is right on that edge. That's why we have that slight chance, mainly just cooler and breezy conditions. As far as snow, that will be pretty rare. That's starting off uh, Saturday, 6.30 in the morning. And then a little bit of snowfall accumulation accumulating between uh, that time and 5 o'clock. And then I'll pretty much be over with. Here is our forecast. Sunny, Twin Falls High, about 76 degrees, 75 for Burley. For the Sun Valley area, your daytime highs in the lower 60s today with sunshine. And for the Long Valley in McCall and Cascade, you're looking at mid-60s, a little bit warmer in Riggins. You should top out around 71 degrees. Western in the valley, sunny skies with highs in the mid to lower 70s today. Same thing for Canyon County. Overnight lows will be in the 40s, pretty mild after our warm day today, tomorrow morning. And then sunny skies for Boise with a high near 75. Again, the record is 78 and some locations could set some records. Then for Saturday, some changes, a slight chance of showers in the morning, cooler and breezy. Then we warm back up. There's a temperature roller coaster ride. Sunday and Monday, we go up and then we go back down, cooler and breezy on Tuesday into Thursday. Brian? 